Coming up, I'll share with you how getting uncomfortable can lead to awesome results. Hey, what's up guys? I'm Antonio Neves for youngentrepreneur.com. And if you're anything like me, you like to challenge yourself. But every now and then we find ourselves in a rut or a bit too comfortable. This reminds me of one of my favorite quotes. If you're not close enough to the edge, you're taking up too much space. What I'm talking about right here is getting uncomfortable. So what do I mean by getting uncomfortable? If you've ever been an athlete, you know that feeling you get in your stomach before the whistle or gun goes off before a competition? Yeah, that right there is uncomfortable. Or if you've ever had to deliver a speech to a large group of people, you know that feeling you get right before you begin talking? Again, that's uncomfortable. For me, those nerves, increased heart rate, or butterflies is a sign that I'm doing something right. I'm pushing myself and getting out of my comfort zone. This leads to growth. Now, many think that to achieve breakthroughs, we have to take massive leaps. That's not the case. Small, consistent steps can lead to major results. So today, I ask you what's one thing you can do to get out of your comfort zone. Is there someone that you could call right now and ask them to be an advisor to your company? Or maybe there's an application to an incubator that's been on your desk for the last few months. How about submitting it? If you've been talking about moving to a new city, how about buying a ticket and going to visit for a few days? Or listen, check the calendar. Maybe there's an event where you can pitch your company to potential investors. Listen, it could be as simple as buying a domain name for your future company taking a class or publishing a blog post. The key is this, do something. Here's the truth. Most of the time, if you wanna know where your future is heading, all you have to do is look at what you did or did not do yesterday. If you crave different results, stepping out of our comfort zone is the first step. So what's one thing that you can do today to get uncomfortable? Let us know in the comments section. To learn more about topics like this, stay right here on youngentrepreneur.com.